In this video, I want to talk about the social aspect of graduate school. So this is a kind of a, a strange topic, but it's an important one. So when you go to graduate school, I really think that it's important that you don't isolate yourself. That's, that's the worst thing that you can do. Many of us uh, who study math are very introverted. When, when I was uh, an undergrad, I, I sat in the back of the class. You know, I didn't, didn't say anything to anyone. I mean, I was really quiet. I was that guy who was afraid to, to ask questions. I would never ask questions in class. And then when I went to grad school, you know, I got a fellowship my first year, free ride, it was great. But that also kind of kept me isolated from some of my classmates, you know, and I was already, you know, really shy and that continued over in grad school. But it really helped me develop, you know, a lot. After my first year, I made some really good friends, one, one friend in particular, he was like my mentor, he's a great guy and uh, awesome teacher too. And I started to, you know, change up a little bit. So I developed as, as a person and, and you will too. And I think it's important that when you go to graduate school that you become social. If you're not social, you, you should become social. We used to have a, um, a Friday thing. Fridays at five, we'd get together at one of the uh, local bars. And it was always kind of amusing because people would come, but they would only hang out for 10 minutes. And a lot of times they wouldn't drink or they would have like half a beer and then leave. Why? Because everyone was so busy. Right? I mean, you have so much homework and it's so hard and nobody can help you. I mean, you, you have the internet, of course, but not all the answers are online, you know. Uh, the teachers aren't dumb. They will come up with questions that you can't find the answers for on the internet. Plus, you want to figure them out on your own. I mean, you're in grad school. You're trying to become better at math. You don't want the answers just given to you. You want to actually work for them and understand and try to learn how to learn on your own. So when you go to grad school, just make sure to go in there with, with a positive attitude and be social. Uh, some of the friends you meet in grad school will become some of the best friends in your life and you'll meet probably the smartest people um, you will ever meet in your life in grad school perhaps. I mean the smartest people I've ever met, I met when, when I was in grad school. Uh, after I left grad school, I was like, wow, you know, <laughs> it's a little bit different. Uh, you know, I don't want to say a step down, but it's, it was different. You know, in grad school, you're surrounded by highly intelligent people. I mean, and, and your college professors are from Yale, they're from Harvard, they're, they're from Princeton. I mean, one of my, uh, one of my professors, one of the professors I worked for, I was, a, I was a TA for a Calc 1 class, and one of the professors who taught the class got his PhD from Princeton. I mean, the guy was like, ah, just a rock star of a mathematician and, and a human being. I mean, you meet amazing people uh, in grad school, and you should embrace that and be social. Good luck and have fun.